So this new body of work titled Shape Memory started in 2018. I had a residency at the Joan Mitchell Center. And while I was there, I wanted to explore a kind of hybrid approach uh, to two other bodies of work I'd made in the past. The term shape memory comes from manufacturing. It's the kind of materials that when you add heat or light or something to that material, it will transform back to another shape. I kept coming back to that kind of innate nature of some of these materials that it was yearning to return back to its former self in a way. In this body of work, I have more sculpture than I've had in a show for a long time. I have worked in sculpture before with ceramics and I've worked with wood before, but maybe not quite to this extent. So I didn't use any pedestals for any of the sculpture in the show. They all feel like characters, like they have their own space. And I brought in all of these crazy color of astroturf. So each one of these scenes in the, sh in the show, they're almost, they're almost like dioramas. The piece titled She's a Frozen Fire, which is located right here in the entrance of the gallery. I love how the sculpture relates to this piece. They seem like they just walked out of that textile piece or they're about to walk into it. In terms of the fire imagery in the show, some of that comes from the frustration that we all have felt over the last year and just wanting to change something. And so each one of these little scenes that I set up here with the turf and the sculptures, I can't help but think of it as kind of like pandemic landscapes. I definitely want to keep going in this direction. When I applied to the Joan Mitchell residency, that was one of the things that I said in my application that I wanted to explore immersive installation. And so I can definitely see the next step, creating a body of work where it's even more dense maybe, with the sculptural forms, the textile pieces, walking through even more immersive landscapes.